Hi everybody, in this video I want to share with you why it is so important for us to heal our digestive system. I have several other videos I've made regarding the same topic, but I wanted to share a couple points in this, um, including an image in this, to help you understand why it is so important. So in some of the other videos that I've made about digestive health, I talked about how if we have an optimally functioning digestive system, it, it will make our own uh, vitamin B12, it makes 80 to 90% of our serotonin, it uh, makes up 70 to 80% of our immune system, it acts as a barrier or a shield against toxins and pathogens to help protect us from those. So it really is an incredibly important system in our body that we need to have functioning optimally in order to stay healthy and in order to overcome health challenges. So when our digestive system isn't working functionally, all types of things start going wrong within our body. And I'll show you how there's just kind of like this cyclical effect that affects different areas in our body that kind of drags our health down altogether. So um, their autoimmune diseases come up. Um, there are over 100 autoimmune diseases and other chronic health issues like Lyme disease and fibromyalgia and rheumatoid arthritis and chronic fatigue syndrome. These all creep up when our digestive system has been broken down long enough and it starts uh, kind of building up health issues within our body that breaks down our health over time. So take a look at this picture right here. This is an image that I created based off of one simple line that I read while researching the digestive system through my holistic health practitioner studies. The one line that um, I read, it said, our blood is only as clean as our bowel. So I really started looking into that. Our blood is only as clean as our bowel. How is that possible? With all the research that I did, I came up with this, um, with this image here to kind of help explain that. So if you look on the left side, uh, sorry, on the right side, um, you'll see that there's the digestive system. You'll see the large colon and the intestines. And it points over to the left to the lymph vessels and to the portal vein. And it goes from there to the liver, from the liver to the body, from the body to the cells. Okay, this is the basic cycle of how um, the digestive system has an effect on our whole entire body. Um, so if you have a digestive system that isn't functioning as it should, it's a sad, poorly functioning digestive system, it can't act as an effective barrier or shield to pathogens or toxins. It does the best that it can, but really there's an excess of toxins and pathogens that are then sent to the portal vein and the lymph vessels, which is then sent to the liver, and the liver is expected to clean all this up. And when this happens over and over again, day in and day out, and the liver is constantly having to clean up this excess of toxins and pathogens, it tends to become overloaded and the liver becomes sluggish. So the toxins that the liver couldn't fully take care of are then released into our general circulation and is entered into our bloodstream, which then affects every cell in the body. And this cycle just happens over and over again. If our digestive system is not functioning as it should, it's constantly putting an extra load of toxins and pathogens into the liver. The liver fully can't take care of it. That goes enters into our bloodstream and that affects our cells. Um, so let's, let's take a look at a healthy cycle here. So if we have a, a digestive system where there's plenty of good bacteria, where there's plenty of enzymes to break down their food, where hydrochloric acid is being produced in the stomach to break it down to even to begin with, and um, we're producing our own vitamin B12 and serotonin and things are moving through as they should. We're having a bowel movement at least one to even three times a day. And so that toxic load is decreased substantially that goes into the portal vein and lymph vessels that then pushes that into the liver and the liver won't have to deal with as many toxins. And um, so there's less strain and stress put on the liver to get rid of those and the liver can slowly begin to heal itself again because of that. And then of course, obviously, there's less toxins put into the bloodstream and we end up having healthier cells because our blood is clean. You can see here why healing the digestive system is so incredibly important. This is the foundational system. You know, I talk about healing the digestive system and the liver and why those two systems are so important for us to be able to heal. And hopefully you understand that a little bit better by looking at this image here. But, um, you know, some people, all they do is clean, clean up the digestive system and over time, 
the liver does heal. But there are things that we can do, extra things that we can do to help heal up the liver. Things like milk thistle or using certain teas or tinctures to help get, a, get rid of liver stones. And um, we can also help address adrenal and thyroid fatigue and help support those two systems as well. So those are all things that I teach about. I do have a video that I'll be sharing soon here that talks about three different ways um, we can heal the digestive system. That's, um, those three options are by either using herbs or by using bone broths and fermented foods or by using a product called Plexus. And there have been lots and lots of questions. I just recently um, shared my research page with everybody about the research that I did regarding Plexus because Plexus comes from an MLM company and um, the way this product is shared can be rather hypey and I think it's I think people are hearing about it so much they think it's just this trend and that it's not really a real product that can do much and and I can see why people feel that way um, I understand how you feel about MLM companies because I've been in the same boat and I was super hesitant with even considering Plexus, but I did weeks and hours of research regarding this um, product and I did I put together a research page that people can read based off of my findings from the research that I did about this product. So I'll have a link to that below this video. Thanks for watching. Hopefully this video has enlightened you a little bit and help and is helping you understand why it's so important to heal the digestive system and hopefully it's helping you understand why we're stuck in this chronic illness cycle and how we can get out of it. So if you have any questions, feel free to contact me. Uh, you can go to healthypreparedness.blogspot.com and click on the contact tab. Thanks for watching. Bye.